it's Christmas Eve, my people. You're welcome to another episode of the today's newspapers on Acid the Hot Channel. Thank you so much for the love and support thus far. Um, today, the 24th day in the month of December 2021. Now, make we quickly move to this newspaper headline before we take to rock the day as the season the be. Vanguard newspaper talk can say end of the year services. Federal government restrict um religious gatherings to 50% capacity, and then talk safe. Uh, we have over 20 million doses of COVID-19 vaccine. Federal government, now you talk that one. Another headline with the Vanguard newspaper, we say, Bleak Yellow Tide for Nigerians as food prices, fares, increase, persists. Hmm. Expression rocks my duguri as Buhari visits. For more story, we could not check Vanguard newspaper. Make we move straight on to the Daily Times. The Daily Times newspaper put in own big headline there, say, We'll be we we'll keep doing our best until we leave in 2023. Now Buhari talk that one. Another headline where they did be say FEC approved 16 contract to boost power transmission. FEC na Federal Executive Council. Another big headline where we now go find there be say regulators by Yasa government disagree on cost of Nembe oil spill. For page five of the Daily Times, we now go find that uh, story. Another headline confession as Oni Oni's queen Naomi announces quitting marriage. Mm, that's one show cool. For more head, more information concerning this matter, we could not check the Daily Times. Uh, we could now move straight on to another newspaper will be Daily Trust. Now, Daily Trust put in own headline there say IBB endorses on Shibajo as 2023 for 2023 presidency. Ah. That's one big deal. So this one are the new, new, new thing about the political circle for Nigeria. Say uh, Ibrahim Babangida in endorse Oshibajo as 20 for 2023 presidency. Now another headline where day for this daily trust be um, commissioned by Mr. President yesterday. Bruno's first flyover will be another landmark of Governor uh, Babangida Zulum. In two years, so and they show the flyover, they do the aerial view, they do the uh, side, they do the commissioning uh, position, post, and everything. We did the more story for daily trust. They could now move straight on to the daily sun newspaper. Two killed, four injured in Ibadan gas tanker crash. Pandemonium in Anambra over tanker explosion. The big headline with the on top daily sun. We I want to talk about now. Now immigration uncovers foreign. Terrorist plot to attack Abuja says Algerians, Nigerians involved en route Mali. Hmm. That was strong. Multiple grenade attacks five. Kills five as Buhari visits Maiduguri, countering violent extremists to the top priority for US Nigeria ties. Envoy talk that one. For more story, we could not check daily sun. For our sporting fans, we put sporting fun the uh, sporting sun here for now. Will be the headline where they did be super eagles tactic on FIFA ranking. Another headline did they say Okoye, we are going from Af for Afcon trophy. Uh, another headline where they did be uh, I will reintegrate Auba if now Aretera talk that one. Proba begins training after COVID-19 threats. For this amortory, we'll go find out for inside the sporting um, newspaper where they call Sporting Sun, which be sports at its best. We could now move straight on to another newspaper. Quick, 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 because time no day. News Direct, Nigeria New Direct, talk and say yellow tie celebration. Federal government slash religious gathering by 50% capacity. Trust to impose additional restrictions on crossover service. Another big headline with the be Union Bank to divest 89.39% of its issued share capital to Titan Trust Bank. Hmm. Don't be that me saying now Union Bank don't change in name. We don't do naming ceremony to Titan Trust Bank. For more story, we could not check and Nigerian News Direct. Another headline where they did ability power supply, PDP administration responsible for Nigeria's suffering. Federal government and I talk that one. Motori for inside Nigeria News Direct. Make we move straight on to the Tribune newspaper. Big headline where they did be hours before Buhari's visit. Explosion rocks my duguri. Three killed military battles. I swap. Big headline where they did another headline for Nigerian Tribune. Titan Trust Bank acquires 89.39 stake at Union Bank. 
Another big headline where Unago see there be police rescue 48 Kano bound traders abducted in Kaduna. Hmm. More headline for Tribune. Make we go quickly to the punch. NIS warns foreign terror attacks. Federal government heightens security. Hmm. We go see another headline there. Divorce. We are probing possible hacking of Olori Naomi's Instagram page, says the Ornis Palace. Lagos State declares Magodo invasion unwarranted. Vows to prosecute culprits. You go see another headline where Bamidele talks say I possess qualities to become the outstanding governor. Now Bamidele talk that one. I go see on for page 15 of the Punch newspaper. Another headline you go, go find there be darkness looms as six power plants halt operations over gas shortage. Page 21 for the Punch you go hear that uh, to read. Five killed as terrorists bomb Maiduguri airport areas ahead Buhari's visits. This are mortuary for the Punch newspaper. We could now move straight on to leadership of Friday. An unforgettable table 2021. US ambassador talked that one. PMP promises end to insecurity as explosion rocks Maiduguri. Says Nigeria is in its final phase of war against terrorism. Hmm. This one's serious. Now, ahead 2023 polls, IPB endorses Osibajo for president. Another headline. Christmas, despite catch trees, Nigeria flood market and the uh, packs. Motory for Leadership Friday. Make we move quickly to national economy. National economy input in what headlines say no respite for Nigeria's dwindling oil export as Shell declares force major. Hmm. Motory for inside national economy, especially for the business people. Yellow tide, sales of poultry products at low ebb. Overprice increase as farmers won ban on maize importation lifted. Another headline we will now go see there be IPB approves 29.75 million dollars to facilitate Nigeria Morocco gas pipe line. Now wait till I get for Una I see the hot a newspaper headline be this one. They could now ensure say you stay safe. You stay good and you put a smile on somebody's face today. I beg you to join me tomorrow for another episode of Newspaper Headlines. Till I see you tomorrow, my people, Merry Christmas in advance.